Hi, my name is Maram. I'm a PhD student at Victoria University and a lecturer at Princess Noura bint Abdurrahman University. Um, today, I will present an introduction for a study under the title Psychoattitudinal Future, a study of female entrepreneur in Saudi Arabia. The paper examined gender-specific attitude of female through the entrepreneurial stages in micro and a small and medium-sized enterprise in Saudi Arabia. And the focus is on gender-based factor. And that is for three main reasons. The participation rate by women in Saudi Arabia are considered among the lowest globally, which accounted for 23% only and for the entrepreneurial activity, 15%. If you look at the figure here, we can see the differences between female and male participation into the workforce. So currently, the government uses only one hand for its development and growth. And if they want to push the economic development of the country, they also need to use the other hand, which is the female. And that is part of Vision 2030, which include uh, greater female participation in business and in entrepreneurial activity. And finally, um, literature suggests also that more work needs to be done on female entrepreneurs in emerging and in developing economy. It's worth to mention that this project is part of a wider study um, that is examined the practice of female entrepreneurs at multi-level. Um, we examine the profile of entrepreneur and the critical success factor as well the enabling and the constraining factor. And in today's presentation, we will only focus on RO2, which is examine the psychoattitudinal features of female entrepreneurs at the micro level. Researchers identify that the institutional context do not fully explain the emergence of entrepreneur. And in this paper, we argue that individual psychoattitudinal factor are also important through the entrepreneurial process. And therefore, we use the big five personality model and risk propensity to understand the entrepreneurial activity by women over the entrepreneurial stages. We use six variable, that is extroversion, emotional stability, agreeableness, openness, conscientiousness, and risk propensity. Why we use this six? Because um, contemporary researcher regarded as the five basic dimension of personality. And also risk taking or risk propensity are considered source of entrepreneurship. Um, in order to understand the collective attitude, we group them into three level, growth, moderate, and fixed. And to understand the movement of attitude over the entrepreneurial stages, we cross tabulate the variable using the following formula, two times five times three, where two represent gender, five represent the five entrepreneurial stages and three represent the three group of mindset. We identified five uh, entrepreneurial stages that is adapted from the global entrepreneurship monitor. Um, the first stages, we describe it as ideation from zero to one year. And then we have nascent, we have developing, and then established. And then finally, we have mature, that is the businesses that, that is more than 10 years. In this way, we can understand the collective impact of attitude over the identified entrepreneurial process. And finally, the paper highlights gender-related strength and some constraint that government and also policymaker 
in Arabic society will need to consider in order to support the participation by entrepreneurial women. This is the end of the presentation. Thank you for listening.